Hello again, Doc of the Clock with more, uh, make a good Mega Man level contest. A, uh, Talk House and Sprites, Inc. So, uh, I did, hopefully done, I've done a little bit of, uh, audio, uh, adjustment. We'll see if that has any effect. Anyway, uh, the game has been updated to a new version. Um, there's a cup there's some bug fixes, uh, a, uh, some new content, and, uh, the, uh, Ferris Shot got a little bit of buff. Which is good, because it kinda sucked before. And it was a good it's a good weapon, but it was really kinda weak. Anyway, let's go looking around and seeing who we haven't talked to since the last time. Base? The old man left me out of his plans again, so I just came down to your lab. Also, I'm not a fish. It's base. Are you safe, fish head? Yeah, base, uh... It's kind of weird how base's life has gone. <laughs> Being, uh... He kind of has turned from Wily's crowning achievement to kind of his... <laughs> one of his biggest mistakes. Uh, I don't think there's anyone here I haven't seen. Solar Man base, maybe? It's actually better use the Solar Flare at close range. Hitting an enemy before the flare explodes will cause double damage. I don't recall his seeing him. I think we saw Crash Man's, though. Sheep Man, I can't believe it! They made my weapon actually useful! I feel so happy and loved! Wait, they still hate me? I'm always gonna hate you, Sheep Man! But don't listen to the haters! You're a Sheep Man! You can do what you want. Were you expecting it? I can't defeat Air Man joke! Sorry to disappoint you, I'm not making that one. That's good, because it probably wouldn't- it probably doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Given that it is, in fact, hilariously easy to beat you. Alright. Okay, Top Man wasn't there before. Whenever you use the Top Spin, you're completely invincible. Bullets go straight through you. Straight through me, huh? That- well, bullets kinda go straight through me anyway, it's just that they actually hurt when they do. <laughs> Um, but, no, with the top spin, they won't hurt! Yay! Let's go do a little pirouette to celebrate. Alright, that's enough of that. What do you have to say, Charge Man? Did you know you can use Magic Card to grab items? Yes, I knew. <laughs> Kinda late in the game to be saying that, don't you think? <laughs> There's Gemini Man. The Gemini Racer is actually segmented, so on rare occasions it can multi-hit enemies. We've seen that in action as well. Yeah, but here's tier 2, uh, 5 through 8. It's the research facility. And here we have 8th place, 128 up, under construction. So, let's go see what we can do. Well, it's, uh... It's a place, and I can go up nice and high for no particular reason whatsoever, apparently. Speaking of the Gemini laser that we just saw Gemini Man talking about, let's go ahead and use that a little bit. It's actually, it's a better weapon than it was before. Still kind of expensive, but the multi-hit property makes it a lot more powerful overall. And it does, on top of that, it feels like it does a lot more damage to a lot more enemies. Yeah. Of course, there are still some points where it's not so good. <laughs> In fact, I can only use one. Okay. I was like, oh boy, that wasn't going to go well. But it went just fine. Because this extra life is easy to grab. <laughs> Most useless. Alternate path ever. Oh, ta. All right, let's pull up a metal blade. Use that for a little while. 
Oh, you know what? Let's use our uh, upgraded Pharaoh shot. Oof. 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 Yes, please. Thank you. Uh, well, I gotta actually not hit him in the front. Oh, yeah. I'd say the Pharaoh shot got an upgrade. Oh, well, they said it did, but, you know, sometimes you have to wonder. And I can't just grab those, uh... I can't just grab those screws from below because, uh, as you might remember, the Fer uh, the uh, magic card cannot fire downwards. Oh, yes. This weapon is going to get a lot more use. I have a lot more opportunities for it now. Alright, we're about back to where we were. And I'm gonna do the smart thing and use Rush Coil actually on that. And break out the metal blades! Because there is I just want to use all the things. Hey, and an e tech. I can go ahead and use one of my own. Not that I really needed to, but I did anyway because well, I'm using stuff. Got all this stuff, why not use it? Ah. A little late on the draw there. Oh, these platforms. scared me. I don't need that life, so I'm going to just leave it there, just in case. Wow. That laser looks like it's gone completely nuts. Okay. Oh, I haven't used much of Top Spin. You know why I haven't used much of it? Because it's... Well, the enemies don't seem to be very weak to it. I have to find the right place and time to use it, which uh, might just might not be the stage. How dare you hide behind a shield? As you can see, this stage is really good technically, even though I don't have... it's not all that unorthodox in terms of design. But, you know, it doesn't have to be unorthodox in terms of design to be good. Whoa. Beat him with it. Can't beat Mets with it. Can't beat Gabules with it. Can't do nothing with it to this stage. Oof. And we're at the end. And little pieces of laser are just flying all over the place. And, wow! I hit the end right as the music was looping. Alright, well, that was... That was pleasant. A nice little rompy stage. Not exceptional, but... It felt like it would fit in a Mega Man game. Also, lots of chance to show off the special weapons. Alright, Ringman. Why is one of the festival areas a research facility? Well, we are a bunch of robots. Research is... A research facility is kind of an interesting place for us. You can't say that research wouldn't be interesting, would you, Ringman? Would you? Hmm? Hmm? Okay, you were designed to kill Mega Man, so maybe you're not as interested in research. 
Found the place! The stove guy! The stage name is Spiky Meltdown, and uh, it is one person's favorite. Oh, I'm gonna leave that extra life because this could end up being a bit of a tricky stage. Yes, it's this one. Okay, this stage has issues. Oof. Gemini Laser? Not so good against uh, Hammer Joe. As you can see, Death Spikes are going to be kind of a common theme. Ah, too early! <sighs> On time there, though. There's another extra life up there, and I wasn't trying to get it, but uh, I accidentally fired up anyway. Yeah, there are some issues with these platforms, so I really kind of want to get through this all in one go. They don't respawn well on death, and on death, and they can sometimes cause some other glitchy happenings. So, whoa. What? Ah, other glitchy happenings just happened! Okay, fortunately, I can hit exit. So let's try that again. No! Ah. Ah! Oh hey, that offending one didn't respawn. That might be good news from... Or maybe not. Well, I guess it kind of was good news for me. Uh, that, yeah, that's, uh, that's an issue that I was aware of. I don't totally blame, uh, on Pyro for that, because I know she worked on it for ages, trying to fix those, and they just kept... they just keep being problematic. Whew. But, okay, good news is we're through that, and that we're past the midpoint now, so... Um, top spin, I think, works on these guys. Yes, it does. The only thing is that, uh, you cannot topspin, uh, you cannot topspin on a ladder, so I have to be careful with that. Fortunately, otherwise, topspin is pretty effective in this area. Finally, a place for it. And a place for Gemini Laser. Absolutely annihilating kitties. I do not mind kitty annihilation. I, you know I'm more of a dog person. Not to say I have something necessarily against cats, I just am leery of them. trust myself in the jump at the bottom here. Okay. I don't like that! Oh, those fleece platforms! They... They... 
Make me mean paint. Oh. Oh shoot. I messed up. I didn't pay attention to what the platform drop is like. Okay, I think I'm at another I think I'm at another checkpoint. And you know There's way too many lives in this stage for me to be happy about. Because they just suggest that there's things wrong with it. If we needed uh, any more evidence than what you've already seen. <sighs> These turrets are just kind of my worst enemy. Oh no, this spot is my worst enemy. This is dangerous. Need to keep going. Just never, ever stop on that. Because those blocks are just going to keep falling. It seems that they fixed one of the issues where uh, the blocks would fall while you were collecting an item. I think that's... Uh, I'm glad for that. Because it just kind of would have uh, made things all the more difficult. Best way to deal with Sniper Joe. Is it Pharaoh Shot? Yes. Pharaoh Shot is basically the answer to everything now. Okay, well not everything, but it's a lot more of an answer than it was. <laughs> no thank you. Those bolts just are so not worth it. I'm really enjoying breaking up the special weapons over and over and over. Hiya! Uh, no! They got me. No, they didn't. I knew that was coming, but. That's a kind of a nasty trick to pull on someone. Still, this stage got, did well enough to get a favor by someone. I'm guessing they didn't have as many issues with glitches. But, I know, uh, I like the design overall. It's, I feel like there's, uh, it gives you just enough leeway to so you don't have the super terrible, awful jumps overall and overall, but, um... Da, 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 da. But yeah, it's... the glitches kind of mess things up. Uh, but, oh, I've spent more than enough time on this, so... Uh, that's all for me for now. Until next time, this is Doc. I'll see you later.